All right, I'm back. Are you ready for this one? Oh, holy cow. 1876. Seated half dollar. Hey guys, welcome back. I'm out making sure my turkey blind is up and secure for this, this spring season. And I came upon a broken arrowhead piece just laying here sun baking on top. You can definitely see it's been worked. Snapped in half right there. It's a pretty cool find. I'll get back on here if I find any more. See you in a bit. Bye. Hey guys, sorry about the wind noise. It's kind of windy out here today. I'm at an old home site that I dug a couple of years ago, but now that I got this new machine, can we read what that says? I got a button. Let's say Arrow Paris. I'm not sure. Pants? I don't know what that says. Pretty cool. See you guys in the next one. Welcome back to my channel, guys. Can you see it? Can you see it right there? Let's check it out, huh? What do we have? Oh, I think we got a Roosevelt dime. Far out. 1950 something. 52. 52 Roosevelt. 52D for Denver. All right, we'll throw that in the pocket and keep on going. We'll see you on the next grapevine. Bye-bye. Hey, guys, I'm back. Sorry about the wind noise today. I uh, was getting a signal. It sounded kind of masked a little bit. I pulled out a little square nail. And then I see that right there. Looks like we might have a barber. 1800s barber. Oh, 1902, there we go, 1902, I will take that, heck yeah, gone a couple days without any, gotta get my silver fix on, 1902, New Orleans, there we go, I'll have to check that one in my coin book. got some decent detail on it the Liberty might be wiped up but I'll get decent pictures later put them up here see you guys bye hey guys I'm back I had to open that hole back up there's a 1940 something weedy that was above that dime and I didn't hear it, I guess. 1947, maybe. I don't know, maybe that was a signal I heard and the dime was below it. Who knows? See you guys on the next one. Hey guys, I was just hitting a 28 on my Manicore and I pulled out a 1943 War Nickel. A 28. And the back is pretty toasted. I'll get it cleaned up at home, get a picture. But 35% silver, that's all right. We will take it. See you on the next one. Bye. Hey guys, welcome back. Out of this hole, I just pulled my first Indian with my manticore. And if you can see that, that says 1890. I'm pretty pleased with that one. I'll clean her up with a toothpick at home and get better pictures. And we'll see you guys on the next one. Bye. Hey guys, I'm back. And out of this hole, I got a pretty cool old hand wrought door latch, it looks like. 
pretty cool. Watch that door. You can see it's twisted. Like a blacksmith would have made that. I don't know. We'll see you guys on the next one. Bye. Hey guys, I'm back. And I got a signal. Right there. Sorry I'm in the, sh in, the in the light, but there's something here. Shotgun. No, hey look here, I got a ring. An old brass ring. Ring up a 21 on my manticore. Just a junker, I believe. Old wedding band style, I guess. All right. We'll see you guys on the next one. Bye. Hey guys, check this out. I got a neckerchief slide. Got one a couple weeks ago at, at the scout camp uh, detecting the heartland. I'm up here at the fairgrounds running a new pattern on my manticore and I just got that. Looks like we're the wolf pack. Cub Scouts. Alright, we'll throw her in a pocket and keep on going. Thanks for coming along. Bye. Very next haul. And if you can see that, that sure looks like a ring in that cloud of dirt right there. There's a little stone in the front of it. It was ringing up a 24, 25 on my manticore. Oop, we dropped it. That's a cute little ring. It's a junker, but it's a ring. I've been on a roll with rings lately. Nothing precious. We'll get her cleaned up and get better pictures, maybe. And see if it has any markings. I doubt it. It's the fairgrounds junker. We'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye. Charlie, buddy, if you're watching, this one's for you. 1901. Good luck, man. Later. Bye. There you go. How's that? Hi, guys. I'm in the hospital. <laughs> Got some issues going on. So, uh, tune in to my next episode, okay? Thanks. Catch you on the next one. Bye. Hey, guys. Welcome back. It's literally been a long time since I've uh, been out detecting. I had a kidney stone, issues going on, uh, a bunch of other crap in my life. I got up here today, and this is my first silver in about four months. So let me turn you around here, and let's take a look at it. So I was getting a jumpy signal on my manticore. Fancy that, huh? And look down in that hole. Huh? We got a worn out old mercury dime down in here. 1918. Pretty cool. And I see a mint mark of maybe a D on the back side there. We'll take that. First silver in months. I'll keep going. See you guys on the next one. Bye-bye. Hey guys, I'm back. Just out for a little bit today out of this hole. I got a, wow, 1939 Denver minted Jefferson Nickel. Hey, that's a low mintage. I will take it. We'll see you guys on the next one. Bye-bye. <laughs>